Hi, my name is Matush Tov, and I want to show you how to create a GeoID in your coordinate system manager. So uh, I have received the GGF file of the GeoGSD 956, which I want to import into my coordinate system manager. So I saved it on my desktop under this folder name. I'll come back to that later. First, I want to open the coordinate system manager uh, in Windows 7 or Vista. Just go to your search bar over here and just start typing coordinate, and it should pop up like that. So I'll open it. Uh, one of the first things I want to do is uh, hit the view button, go to options, and this is the directory where all my GGF files are stored. So I want to make a note of it or copy it. So right click copy. I can cancel it. I don't want to modify it because all my geode model files are stored in there. So I want to open a new Windows Explorer window. Hit the top button, right click and take my location, hit enter. And as I can see, here are all the GGF files. Now I want to copy the file a customer sent me uh, into that directory, so I'm just gonna drag it and drop it over here. Right? Uh, you might want to move it. I'm just gonna copy it at this point. So it's right here. Okay, close these two windows. Go back to my coordinate system manager and uh, hit the geoid models. Hit them edit. Add the geoid model. Call it. The name is really important. Uh, because you have to keep the name consistent to your calibration files. So that's one of the reasons you want to create your own geo, right? So, gsd 95 fix is the name. And then I'm going to hit the down arrow button and scroll down until I find the file I just copied in there. gsd 95 fix ggf Click OK. Hit Apply. OK. And you can see right here is a new GSD 95 fix geoid, right? So, uh, pretty much done. Uh, one more thing before I do this, uh, I want to close the Coordinate System Manager. I want to make sure I save it so next time when I open it, that GSD 95 fix is going to be in there. And it's as easy as this. 